I'll take it. Oh, he's settled into this one. A healthy crowd. Brisbane Entertainment Centre. Harrison. Good footwork. Got the basket and the foul. Still incredibly young, a big career ahead of him. To get on the big stage in front of NBA oh, is a big opportunity. And that's what Crane has been doing well all season. Side he's used to travelling and doing some kilometres. Here's the breakers. Jackson Cartwright. Like a little mass mismatch on Harrison. Put on a move, got some separation. I like that timeout. They just need to get some better looks. This might be a good look. Meninga! Throws it down, and they might be able to get something going on offense. Brisbane finished with some momentum going into the second half. They go to Harrison. He's double teams. He's still good enough to put on a move and finish. And that's a nice end of the half for the Brisbane Bullets. New Zealand shoot the ball better. They're shooting under 40% from the field. Speaking of shooting, Bannon's been struggling, continuing to struggle. But there's Harrison on the offensive glass with a putback. Casey Prather. This is what they need to see from him. So important to the success they have this year. No, see, great feed to Meninga. The two games, both undefeated. Brisbane they got their first win last week. Bold's already knocked one down. Two good looks. They have. They've had two good, look, look, good looks, but I like the way they've attacked the offensive rebound. As King finishes a hard one there. It really looks like they're giving them a great boost when they come into the game. Rocco, Bateman starting, but Smith, Milner, Zakarski, you know, what do you guys think about them? Uh, we're only playing the two games, but I think it means everything to this team just as much. I mean, Coach Cobbett spoke about it before the game, didn't he, Pete, about the character and no excuses. No one's really going to care. There's PJC. I think they just tick every box right now. Alice, where are you at right now? I'm... I'm Sydney Kings and Illawarra. I'm liking the way both of them are playing, and that's a nice move by Bateman right there. Just haven't been able to shake off the breakers. Cook left it short. Is able to get it back. And now Bateman again. What a player. He was struggling through the first three games. So much noise on the outside. He gets moved to the... Turn over to finish. And Bateman with the exclamation mark. He'll finish with a game high, 21 points. And that'll see the Brisbane Bullets with back-to-back -back wins.